Hey guys, welcome back to Frozen Pixel Gaming, and uh, this is part three. Um, I know I told you guys I was gonna do like the whole entire stage, like every part, but uh, I was uh, getting interrupted and stuff. And um, on top of that, I had very very bad runs. It was like I kept dying constantly, so um, I just I cut it to a couple stages and two parts for the next world, but. Oh well, though, you know, we'll have to just work with that. You have to turn in the band-aid here, and then you finally get your hovercraft. If you jump over here to the left, you can actually go pick up some bananas, or a banana bird. Concave. This, this next area, um, I absolutely hate it, and as you can tell, I am doing a voiceover right now because I don't have, um, like, my mic right now is inside of my Mac, and if I record the gameplay and I talk, it's just, you're gonna hear, like, two games, so you're gonna hear, like, the game playing in the background, and my voice, and it's gonna sound all weird and stuff, so I just play the game, record it, and then go ahead and do a voiceover afterwards but once I get my headset I'll be able to do you know the simultaneous thing but for now we'll have to do it with with what works well, I cut I cut the video here because I um this is where I died a lot being an idiot because it's like I kept rushing and um when I kept rushing I kept running into these damn fish and it annoyed me I hate water stages it, it, it's like I hate water stages and I hate ice stages. I've already done this bonus by the way, but I'm doing it again so you know what's that. But these ice stages and water stages, I hate I hate them because you slide or or when when you're swimming and you tap the one, you know, just because you got to you got to get up there and it's like you just tap it once and you start swimming up and then you realize you're like, "Oh, that's one too many taps." And then you hit a fish and you die. I hate that shit. But you know, I guess you get used to it. After like 30 lives, I was like, okay, finally I got it. I got it, finally. But hopefully I don't have to go through that again. This stage didn't give me uh, too much of a problem before, so I don't know what... See right there, I almost hit that fucking fish. But... Yeah, this is like the first time the stage has ever given me like a huge problem. I'm gonna have to add this one to the list of stages I truly hate. I might, when, like I said before, that I might do a, um, like a full on, you know, like play three and then two, and then if I felt like it, play one. And then out of all three games, I might make like a top 10 hated stages of Donkey Kong Country, period. And like, cause, there's a couple stages that just frustrate the shit out of me, and I'm pretty sure there's gonna be some in every other game. And I'll probably be able to pick out 10 very easily, and I think that would be a cool video. I don't think I've ever seen something like that on YouTube, so... Somebody beats me to it because they heard this, and... Good stuff. But otherwise, um... I'll have one of those up one of these days. It's taking me a lot longer. I really hate editing. I don't know, it's just like a pain in the ass. I got a shitty computer. And even just to like do a voiceover, it takes like half an hour for like a 10 minute video. So you can understand why it's annoying as fuck. And then it's like an hour just to get the video up and then all that crap. If I, if I could do it faster, like maybe if they had like actual streaming where I could just play the game and talk at the same time. And as I'm playing, it's like being uploaded because of the stream. That'd be nice. There we go, I finally actually did this stage without dying. A DK coin is right behind this, it's pretty easy to get. Just pick it up, jump on top of the shield, throw it to the right, bam, there you go. <clears throat> Had to block my sneeze there, I didn't want to freaking sneeze on camera. Or on the mic. These stages are actually pretty fun. Like, I find them to be, uh, pretty fun. Except for the... Except for the freaking... The bees. You gotta, like, go between bees and stuff with the barrels. 
But other than that, it's pretty easy and kind of fun at the same time. There'll be like three or four similar stages to this one. I was thinking of, uh, like I had the idea before I saw it, but at the same time when I saw it, it kind of bummed me out that somebody else already did it. I was thinking about doing a, a let's play for um, Animal Crossing, but you know how like the game, it's like you don't play it all day. You you play it to um you know to do what you have to do for that day. Then what you do is you, you stop playing, and of course the next day everything resets. So There'll be like new stuff in the store, or you'll have like I don't know, you'll have like some new stuff in in um in Lost and Found. Well, this is this is judging Earth. Because I played the first one, I never played the second one for the Wii. And uh, I was thinking about playing the one for the Wii, because I never played it. And I thought it'd be kind of cool to do like a let's play every day, like for 20 minutes every day. And I wanted to do it for like a long time, just so all the seasons change in the game and you find all kinds of stuff. But at the same time, when I saw that, there's a, I guess there's a guy, I'll put him on a link description if you guys are interested. Um, there's a guy that does that already, and he has, like, I guess he's gonna do it for a year. And, um, that's kinda cool, but kinda sucks because I wanted to play it too. But, I mean, I was thinking, it's like, it could be, like, maybe, like, a year challenge. Maybe it could be, like, a Animal Crossing challenge or something where, if you're up to it, if you have the game also, play for a year. Like, do a Let's Play every day for a whole year and kinda see where you go, and progression-wise. I'd say, I'd recommend playing it only like 15 minutes a day though, because I can only imagine like how boring it would be if like half a year later, if you played it every day for like four hours, you know, you're not gonna have much to do. Well, you will have stuff to do, but you know, you did most of it. So, play it a good just 15 minutes and then you're set. That and um, I really wanted to play Mario Galaxy even though everybody's played Mario Galaxy, but this, like, the game seems pretty awesome, and I really want to play that game. Especially since I've heard that, I don't know, I've just heard nothing but good stuff about it, and that it's, like, one of the best Wii games and stuff, so it's kind of thinking about playing it. This one's pretty easy, you just make sure you don't miss the freaking coins. See, there's a star, like, right on that barrel. And I think I missed it here. Yeah, I missed it on the first run. But make sure you watch out for that when you do it. Because the barrel won't let you get it. And here I go back and I'm like, oh man, what the fuck? And it's, you can see it right here. Damn, got it. Too late though. Um, by the way, if you guys like Donkey Kong, uh, anything, if you guys want, like, um, how to say it, um, I don't know, an active subscriber, subscribee, whatever, make sure you subscribe because I'll be doing a lot of videos every day and stuff, so if, um, you enjoy it or whatever. Make sure you subscribe because I'll be get, having a bunch of content out for everybody to watch and listen to, even though it's not that exciting for now. Until you're more comfortable with it, of course. But with time, everybody, you know, gets used to that. And I personally feel like I'm getting a little bit more used to it. It's not the same anymore. I used to be more like, oh my god, I don't want to do it, but now I don't mind it. It's, you know, I learned to talk about whatever over just talking about sceneries in the game like I used to where it's like oh there's a there's a rock right there and it's pretty oh look at that it's so nice no I, let, I just talk about whatever anyways I'm gonna end it here for part one and I'll have a part two up soon and it'll be the rest of the stage in the boss so make sure you guys subscribe and comment and uh, let me know what I should play next